technology is the application of materials smaller than 100 nanometers for the development of new products such as targeted drug delivery devices, thin flexible solar cells, and sensors for environmental toxins. We are visiting the Air Quality Engineering Laboratory at Virginia Tech to follow the journey of a nanoparticle. Our laboratory's work has shown that nanoparticles are readily aerosolized during the manufacturing process. They can then be transported thousands of miles in the atmosphere. Once they're in the atmosphere, nanoparticles may undergo reactions that will change their surface chemistry. Nanoparticles may also coagulate with other particles in the atmosphere, and then their fate is tied together. Some nanoparticles may be hydrophobic and will sorb to sediment when they encounter aquatic environments. But atmospheric processing may make some nanoparticles more hydrophilic, such that they can be transported great distances in water and present a hazard to organisms. For example, exposure to C60 fullerenes has been shown to cause oxidative stress in the brains of largemouth bass. She glided with style.